You know, a lot of people who are learning JavaScript run into a block in their learning curve when they want to start developing AJAX applications, but they're not on a team uh, that has AJAX backend APIs that they can use. Or maybe they're lear you're learning at home um, and you don't have access to anything that gives you the ability to start doing that. I thought about that over the weekend a lot, and so I put together a free RESTful API that you guys can learn uh, used to learn Ajax on your own. So, yay for you guys. You get to do that now. Um, I had a lot of people who went through the jQuery tutorial where we do cover how to build a single page app. And you guys asked me, hey, what can I do? I don't have access to an API. So, here you go. No excuses. Now you have access to an API. This should give you all the code you need to do it anyway. Uh, but I'll give you the miniature, like, two-minute walkthrough. Basically, um, the data resets every night. So, it's not going to last forever. That's kind of my way of making sure I don't have this gigantic server full of pointless data. Um, and it's not secure. Anybody can guess your username and access all the data you post. So it's just for learning. Um, and then here's kind of how you use it. If you just go rest.learncode.academy, uh, go API, and then pick a username, in this case Will, and then friends, you have access to all the friends that you've created. Of course, if it's the first time you did it, say Willis, then that, fr that collection will be empty. It will be created the second you try to uh, access or post to uh, username Willis collection friends. So I can have Willis friends, I can have Willis tweets, and there you go, empty collections. Uh, so then you can just snatch the code and post to that collection. Let me snatch this, open the console, or you guys can do it from your web application. Let's post to Willis friends. I'm going to add my friend. Let's go ahead and reload that. There you go. Now I have a friend called Billy Bob. Let's go ahead and run that a few more times. Of course, I don't have jQuery on this page, so I can't do that. Let's, ah, where am I? There you go. Let's post that exact same thing like three more times. I just ran it and just kind of re-ran it. So now if I refresh Willis friends, I have three friends with different IDs. So now I can modify those with a put request. I can delete those with a delete request. Let's do this. Delete Willis friends ID one. Let's go ahead and delete you. Let's go check again. Now I have three friends. Let's refresh. And I, I have two friends now, ID2 and ID3. So yippee, there you guys go. That is your API. Enjoy it. Let me know if you run into any problems. And also, if you build anything cool with it, comment below. I'd love to see what you guys are building as you're learning Ajax. Have a good day.